Alhamdulillah wa salatu wa salam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'da. Habita fillah. I think we often tend to underestimate the importance of seeking forgiveness for others. Meaning to pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that someone else is forgiven. And that takes very strong iman and very strong will power and the determination and uprightness and righteousness to do that, especially if someone has wronged, wronged you. That if someone has caused you a harm, for you to then in turn seek forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for that person, ask that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgives them, this takes iman. And this takes patience. And this is sabr al al fi. This is patience on the harm that comes from mixing with people and the harm that comes from sometimes dealing with people that you may not want to deal with. Listen to this beautiful hadith of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, which encourages us <clears throat> to seek forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the believers in general. And you'll see that from this hadith, that there is forgiveness for you in seeking forgiveness for your brothers and sisters in Islam. An Ubadat ibn Samit radiallahu ta'ala anhu qal, qala Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, man astaghfara lil mu'mineen wa lil mu'minat, katab allahu lahu bi kulli mu'min wa mu'mina hasana, akhrajahu tabarani, Imam al-Bani, al-Bani, In this hadith of the Prophet is a hadith of Ubadat ibn Samit radiallahu ta'anhu. He said that the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, whoever seeks forgiveness for the believing men and believing women, Allah will write for him, for every believing man and believing woman, hasana. And Imam al-Albani declared that this was a sound, authentic hadith uh, that was collected in Tabarani. So this hadith, Ahabat Fillah, shows us the importance of du'a lil-ghayb, uh, of, of supplicating and seeking forgiveness for people who are not uh, in your presence. And likewise, what we learn from this hadith of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is the importance in general of making dua and seeking forgiveness for the believers in general. That this is an important trait of Ahl sunnah It's an important trait of Ahl iman And this is an important trait of the classical scholars, the people of wara, the people of taqwa, who feared Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and, and avoided his prohibitions and adhered to his commands. And the people of humility, and the people of love, that they love and love to spread love between the mu'mineen. So this is a trait that we want to try to implement in our lives and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. And may Allah bless us with ikhlas, with thabat, ala sunnah. And may Allah tabarak wa ta'ala bless us to practice this and supplicate for the believers in general. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have mercy and forgiveness and grant the believers everywhere uh, success and forgiveness and prosperity and righteousness and righteous conduct. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiya na Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.